hello guys hope you all are good today i'm going to show you how to execute the search query in android using php mysql um, before we go through the main coding part of the android i would like to show you the tables i have created for the demo purpose please open mysql and choose database here i have chosen uni as my database and created one table named as example you can create any as per your choice and taken i have taken here two fields country and city and entered some of the dummy data for this example what actually we are going to do here is uh, user is going to enter the country and based on the country entered by the user the cities are going to be populated so here it is here uh, this is my table now let us go through the main part of the android before we go through the main activity dot java i will show you the my designing part or the xml part of this example here i have taken three fields the edit text for letting the user enter the country name in this example the button is for search and the spinner the spinner will populate the data as per the country entered by the user it will display the populated data now let us go through the main activity dot java this is the declaration part definition part hope you are familiar familiar with this uh, connection part and the json part below for uh, getting the json response from mysql using php let us let me show you the main part of this example that how will you pass the parameter or filter text to get the filtered data from mysql here i have defined one variable text and storing the entered text in the string format and text variable also take on the instance of the content values this will append the enter text in the url for filter filtering purpose here i am appending the variable name text for the filter purpose the url will be executed and the text variable part would be fetched by the dollar underscore get in php part let us go through the php part hope you are familiar with the connection part dollar underscore get here here dollar underscore get will fetch the uh, past text variable string in it and i am storing that string in dollar underscore ia variable here i am executing the filtered query and fetching the response in json format this is the output screenshot of the outputs here for uk two cities are populating and usa new york mexico indiana you can enter your relevant data into the database for your as per your need and purpose if you are facing any queries then you are you are feel free to ask me in the comments you can get the detailed code at www. the technology updates. dot com. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Twitter at twitter. dot com slash slash cc cdc. Thank you for watching.